Eric the Red in with his daughters, which are all half Shamus. You guys want some of this? Want some of this? Yeah, that's good stuff, huh? Special treat. He's got nice white legs. He throws he throws chicks with white legs, although, as you can see, these guys don't have white legs. I really like the blue hen here that's got the the blue shanks. Black shanks. The other one's kind of got green legs. So these will end up being three-quarter three-quarter ganoi. Which should be pretty cool. He is a beautiful, beautiful bird. His, his tail feathers are not, are not fully in right now, but when they are, they look magnificent. Yeah, nice birds. He's got a good temperament, too. As long as you don't get him around another rooster. He likes to scrap with the other roosters. Don't you? You good boy. You good boy there, Eric. The girls need names. They don't have any names yet. As you can see, I installed one of those horse feed as a egg box, nesting box. I got that nesting box. I just love that blue coloration. Really something. He's got super good posture, nice straight legs, fantastic tail. Got an awesome tail on Yeah, he's a good boy. He's a good rooster. Aren't you, Eric? You good boy? So, in about a month or so, a month and a half, we'll be able to see what his babies look like. I got a few of his eggs that might be viable that I'm going to stick in the incubator and see what happens. But we really need the weather to warm up for the eggs to be good. It's just too darn cold. You can see, look, snow right there. Snow in their dust bath. Good boy. Little Ragnar. Half Cobra seal, half Riza a seal. That's his mom. I've paired him up with his mom. White shanked Riza a seal. At least I think that's what she is. I know she's in a seal. They do some good eating birds. His father, Ragnar, was just crazy. Ragnar the Assassin would attack me any chance he had. This guy, as you can see, is really mellow, really tame. It's a nice bird. And that hen lays the most eggs of any a seal I have. She probably laid 40, 50 eggs last year. She lays a pile of eggs once she gets going. She has laid uh, I think she's laid one this year so far. She hasn't laid any eggs yet, which is fine since it's too darn cold anyways. Gonna hatch out a few of his eggs, her eggs. She is quick and so is he, lightning fast. She gets out, there's no way you'll catch her. You can't really catch him either, even though he's pretty tame. Not unless he lets you. It's a really pretty, really pretty bird. Would make for a fantastic free range chicken. If you were looking to like raise some really good eating birds. They have a very dark, kind of dark meat. A lot, a lot, you know, more dark than uh, 
those commercial Frankenstein birds. You good boy. Not very cost effective though if you're feeding them feed. Those are a beautiful pair. Yes, you are. That's a nice looking bird. Wow. Just magnificent. So Cole looks like crap right now because he got in a fight with Odin. Come here. Come here. Come here. Oh. You quiet man. You be quiet. So I currently have seven hens in here. Those are his daughters. I got four nesting boxes for them. Yeah, he got, got scruffed up pretty bad. You have to wait for his feathers coming for him to look good. But I should get some good, good chicks out of this flock. I still haven't gotten any eggs out of here yet. They just started laying the other day. I got four eggs. From them. But like I said, it's been really cold. It's hard to get, hard to get your eggs when it's so cold. That's a fake egg I got right there. He's a really pretty bird when his feathers are all scruffed up. He weighs about nine pounds. Like eight, eight, eight point eight. Just a little, just a tad under, tad under nine pounds. scruffy because he's been mating with them. So hopefully by the end, end of the month I'll be able to get some eggs in an incubator from these guys. Get them, get them hatching. See what the babies look like. I'm hoping to get some babies that have long tails. Last year I got a bunch of, bunch of, uh, bunch from him that were short-tailed. There was only a couple that had, had that nice tail that I like. And speaking of eggs, there's an egg right there. Oh, and that's warm. That's a good egg. That's the first egg I've gotten out of this pen that hasn't been frozen. I'll put that in the incubator. 